This is the last part of Attack of the Saints, it's called Cornfield and this guard is on the purest difficulty. Now to start here you just have to wait for those lots of guards to have gone, uh, well not gone, turned around, turned their back on you, then you can just sneak past them into the cornfield. So at the start here there's quite a bit of, um, well there's just a bit of walking so I'll explain a little bit more about this mission. So I'm not going to explain how to do the different challenges in this area and um, uh, the kind of weird part about this mission, or the the way to do it, is to use the corn because uh, when you are in it, you are very very difficult to detect. And I'm going to put on a disguise that makes it even more difficult. Basically, I'm going to pick up the scarecrow disguise, and what that means is that you can be standing right next to uh, an enemy, and they won't detect you. But if you move, they will detect you. So the way it works is that if you put it on. You can't, you can't be detected and as long as you are inside the cornfield so even if there's only a couple of corn uh, <laughs> corn plants between you and the edge of the field you will still be hidden so yeah make sure at the start that you stay on the right side of the cornfield as at the very start when I first entered the cornfield um, otherwise you have to avoid some guards and here you can just uh, go back wait for that guard to have gone behind the truck a little bit early and then you can just make your way across a little um, little path there and here you just have to wait a while until the two guards to the right have gone and even then you will hear to get a noticed noise but it doesn't matter just go into this corner and then it will stop and you can rig up the uh, power to the little hut and then pull the lever straight away you won't be detected and then you can make your way back into the cornfield and then make your way around the edge here which will mean that you won't be detected by guards too easily. Now, sometimes, if you don't take the exact same path as I did, which may be difficult, you know, remembering exactly where I went and so on, you you may run into guards that you didn't expect to run into. By the way, you can just go across here at the start. Um, they <laughs> very handily get into position. You just have to, when you hear the be notice noise, just stand still and see which guard it was. And then once that guard is gone, you know, just keep going. Here you just have to wait for uh, the next target to show up, which is right there. And she'll always stand next to this little scarecrow across, which you can see there. Just wait near it, really, and wait for her to come uh, show up. Then just follow her. Uh, until she stops walking, which is when she's near the fence, and then garret her. But I'm not gonna hide her body because <laughs> there's no way to do it unless you were to drag her around the place quite a lot, and um, that's not really feasible. So just leave her lying about there. Eventually, they'll discover the body, but you'll be far away, and it won't matter. Now, you might notice that the screen will start flashing soon. Uh, that isn't me being detected, that's just the guards finding the body. Here you just have to wait at the edge of the cornfield a little bit until the guards get into the right positions. It should happen very quickly here, basically right now. There's two guards to the left, they look the other way, there's another guard to the right, but he's stationary. Now you can easily make your way across. Here stay again at the edge of the cornfield, otherwise you're going to run into guards patrolling the area and make your way towards that tree and sit next to it. Yeah, so that was a body being found on me being detected and uh, a guard will show up as you can see there of course this footage is sped up a little bit just uh, when I'm waiting and um, he will leave shortly and then you can make your way across the um, little road here and into the next cornfield and in this cornfield uh, <laughs> uh, you can um, sub no Garrett this last target but I think shooting the um, the platform there with the barrels of sand on it, no, the, not the barrels, the bags of sand, there's a better way of doing it, because it just means you don't have to worry about as many guards finding you. So uh, just wait for her to be there, she stands there, and then she walks towards it, and a short while after that, just shoot the um, chain once, and then the stuff will drop on her. And now you just have to wait for them to settle down a little bit, which will take a while, but eventually they'll settle down. Basically once that guard has gone back to the right, and keep an eye on the guard to the left there to have turned around and then you can make your way between that uh, truck there on the left and the uh, what are they called? I don't know. But anyway, that's this guide. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video and until next time.